Hey lovelies, how are you? I hope you're all doing well. Welcome back to my channel if you're new. Hi. <laughs> Today I'm going to be doing a Penny's haul. Quite a big bag here. Um, I did one of these nearly once a month now. It's actually getting ridiculous. But we all know. We just know. I'm not, I usually do these in order of like beauty clothes, shoes. But I'm just going to dig into the bag and start pulling out because the, the bag is all over the place. Okay. Okay. So if you want to see that, stay tuned. The first thing I picked up is these My Little Pony pajamas, And they say, I believe in unicorns. And I just had to have them because they're so cute. And because I have an obsession with pajamas, obviously. And these are the legs off them. They say believe on the band, which I love. And they just have the little ponies and rainbows all over them. So cute. The legs were 10 euro and the top was 8 euro. They have little lavender um, shorts as well to match them on a little vest top in the My Little Pony collection. I'm not going to get them though. I'm not. I seriously found out yesterday I have issues with pyjamas like... I had a pile of pyjamas downstairs that I couldn't bring up, a pile of clothes, sorry, that I couldn't bring up to my room because I had no room because, you know, I can't stop shopping. I'm looking around because I'm like, still looking and still packed even though I don't, the time used to clear out yesterday. And yeah, so I was like, right, I'm after getting rid of stuff, I'll be able to bring some of the pile up. So I said, so I'll start with pyjamas because they were all in like little separate piles. So I brought up all the pyjamas and I said, the crack we'll just count how many clean pairs of pajamas there is 35 yeah 35 pairs of clean pajamas that's not normal i know it's not normal but i'm like i guarantee you i could go in there tomorrow and be like look at them i need them and buy them I buy two pairs sure but like i i need i need to try and stock 35 pairs of pajamas like and the, probably about 20 in the press already Cupboard, whatever, if you don't understand press, it's an Irish word for cupboard. Or drawers, whatever. Oh, whatever. But yeah, I was I was shocked, like, do you know what I mean? I don't know why I was so shocked considering I keep buying pajamas. Because, you know, I have got another pair here to show you. Yeah. I was about to say I've seen these and I need them. But that's the story, that's the case with all pajamas that I buy. Wake me for food. How cute. Look at the little face on the shake. I had to have them. I had to. And I like these as well because the leg on them is just plain like but it's just a little crop leg. You know when you're too warm. Not too not too cold, not too warm. A crop leg. Perfect. I have one pair of crop leg pajamas, so really I did need these. <laughs> Still trying to justify. They were only eight euro as well for the set bargain like you couldn't be leaving them there do you know what I mean you couldn't next out the lucky bag is this belt I wanted a belt like this for ages and I I went up I'd say I put it in my basket it's a bit of fluff bomb in front of me I'd say I bought put it in my basket on ASOS about 50 times no word of a lie and went to pick it up in Topshop lots of times but I don't know why I just never bought it but I'm glad I didn't because I got this one it has like this detailing on the end of it and then the detail buckle. I don't have any belts, you know, that's the one thing I don't have. And this was five euro in a pennies, Primark, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, so bargain. Then I picked up these shades. These were three euro. I was wearing these today, but can't wear them in this video because, yeah. I don't even need to say why I can't. You can see. But um, three euro, brilliant little bargain. And I didn't have silver ones. I have gold. I have tart. Everything, no silver. So they were a must. I am going to Benidorm in ten days. Well, I'm probably I could possibly it'll be less by the time this goes up because I have to record those videos today because it's my last day of work before I go away. 
I'm working nine days straight before I go away. I'm gonna be bollocked on holidays, but I'll soldier on. So I picked up this little bikini top. Uh, uh, uh. Double strapped at the back. This was seven euros. I think I might return this though. Because it's not made for people with boobs, apparently. It's just made for flat chested people. Even though they come in all the sizes. I tried this on and you know, I had a lovely little bit of nipple coming out of either side. Now I'm all about for the nip, like, but not really the look you're going for when you put on a bikini, is it? I'm raging though because I love the colour of this and I was like, oh it'd be so nice with my black high waisted um sneakers. But that's gonna be a no no, that's a return. I never return anything to Penny, so that's one for the book. But I really need to hang these up actually if I'm bringing them on holidays with me. I got this bodysuit. It's in a ball of creases, that's fab. We all know this is my favourite colour by now, but if you're new you don't know that, but this is my favourite colour. You will learn to know that. Um, yeah, this was, how much was this? Six euro. Bargain. If you're not um, into, if you're into bodysuits, I'm into this, but not into the colour. They come in, I got a few colours, I think they had them in mint green. I think, I like a lemony colour. Black. There's a few colours in the new for six euro, they're perfect, I'm just going to show that on on holidays off the shoulder with a nice little skater skirt and my wrap up sandals sort of not maybe nice little chill care we'll see I'm so excited to go away look I am sweating for it it's just me and three four of the girls now three of the girls going and it's gonna be great sorry sweat dance I don't know why the fuck my earphones are in my bag in that bag considering they should be in my handbag here Then I picked up another pair of fluffy sliders because I'm obsessed. <laughs> These are the comfiest thing ever. Most comfiest thing ever. These were six euro, weren't they? Yeah, six euro. Could you go wrong? I don't think so. These, I actually wore these. If you're wondering how to style them or not sure on how they look on. I done a blog post, an alpha post on these. I will link it in the description if you want to go and check it out. There's a lot of hand movements there, don't mind me. So, then I picked up these little shorts again in my fave colour, again in a ball of creases. Sorry, I, I'm an awful habit just leaving things in bags. And I would have went to try them in my case now later on and been like, oh, grand, best iron. But uh, I love this. These were 3 euro. Three euro. I didn't know that's all they were. Um, I'm obviously gonna get more of them. They come in loads of colours: black, red, grey, pink, I think, orange, like so many colours: yellow, everything. For three euro, bargain. <laughs> I'll definitely be picking more of them up tomorrow now. They're so comfy. They're grand. Like, do you know what I mean? Just a little, little booty short. And the weirdest thing ever. Then I picked up more fishnet socks. Uh, these are white ones, that are clearly. I don't have white ones. One of the few colours I don't have. So this is a two pack. A two pack for two euro. Would you be going wrong? I don't think so. But you would be if you didn't like them. I love them, so I wouldn't be going wrong. And I picked up this choker. I love this. These little moons. I have a thing for the moon. I love it. Um, craving a tattoo lady and I want to get some of the moon together. You didn't need to know that, like I'm just showing you the choker, but yeah, I want a tattoo of the moon. And this was five euro. Cute on holidays. Everything is gonna be cute on holidays. Do you ever find that before you go away? You're like, oh yeah, that'd be cute on holidays, pick that up. I'm only on for like five days. I go Thursday, one Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and back Monday, nine. So yeah, five days with loads. I don't particularly need a lot. I probably could have got away with not buying anything considering the amount of summer clothes I already have. 
but I know, you know, you need to pick up the few bits. Yeah. Then I picked up some of these silicone sponges just to give them a go. And I'm actually going to try them after this. Yeah, you get two in it for two euro. I picked up two of these, one to go in a giveaway and one for me to try out. Has anyone tried this? If so, let me know. And maybe they're not the best ones. I don't know. They feel good though. Um, I have to say, Penny's like makeup game is just unbelievable. I was recently up in the head office, like looking at a lot of stuff that's going to be coming in. Unfortunately, I can't tell you or show you any of that stuff that's coming in. I like I have pictures of it all. And I would love to show you, but just take my word for it. Like some of the stuff that's coming in is sick, sick, and just on par with every like other drugstore makeup that you're gonna buy. Like people seem to have this thing against Penny's makeup, don't they? It's like, oh no, I wouldn't wear that. I wouldn't put that on my face. I personally love. I use a Penny's um, one of the PS Pro foundations, and I personally love it. Like, and I always get compliments when I have it on. Everyone's like, what foundation is that? Like Penny's. Fuck off. No, sorry, it is like. <laughs> but, um, and I, I have mentioned their mascaras in a few of my favourite videos before. Like, their stuff is great, like. And that's what I was up there and learning about, basically, you know, new stuff that's coming in and, you know, how stuff is made and everything. Like, and they go through the same process as everyone else. Like, you know, they can't just make sure you stick it in a tube and sell it to you, like, basically. I couldn't believe it, like. I really couldn't. Some of the stuff. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm going to shut up now. And I picked up some of the banana powder. Again, I haven't tried this. I might actually do a full face first impression video of stuff I haven't tried. I need to record like a good few videos today because as I said it's my last day off before I go away so I kind of have to bulk record today so I can edit and have them ready to go up as I'm away and because I'm in work for nine days I won't have a chance to record so I'm gonna have to record uh edit and just have them there to go up you know over the next couple of weeks two weeks really I suppose yeah so I need like five videos to do today so maybe i'll do that but anyways everyone goes mad for this stuff when it's in four euro um i've never tried any kind of banana powder but i'm gonna give this a go again i got one for myself and one to try on a giveaway if there's anything you'd like to actually see in the giveaway i'm going on about this giveaway ages now because it's i'm picking up penny stuff i want to obviously have a lot of it but it's not just penny stuff that's in it, like there'll be brand stuff in it as well, like you know what I mean? Um yeah, but if there's anything in particular that you think would be a good idea or that you'd like to see in a giveaway and I'd make you enter a giveaway, comment below in the comments and let me know. I think this is the last thing then that I picked up and it is this PF uh self tan mousse. I mentioned this in the video before um this is 350 and it's 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 a good time I have to say it's a great color uh, it's a great color what am I talking about yeah I enjoyed this tan <laughs> I enjoyed it it's great uh, <laughs> yeah this is for 350 it's a good tan you'd only wear it like I know most people only wear tan on a night out, but some people wear it all the time. I have gotten into that habit. But this one, I didn't do tan. Like my tan that I had to do the night before and wash off the next day before going out last weekend. And I just whacked this on me going like an hour before and or something. And it looked great. Lovely colour. Lovely payoff. Um. Yeah, it doesn't stink because it has apricot oil in it. Apricot oil. Apricot oil. Yeah, because it has apricot oil in it. It doesn't smell too bad either. So if you're looking for a tan, a cheap tan, like 350, come on. Give it a go. See what you think. 
I think that's everything that I bought. I'm just rambling now and shiting on me and thinking out loud. So I'm going to leave the video there. So I'm going to leave the video there. If you're new, subscribe. Do all that stuff down below. Like, comment, subscribe. And let me know what you thought of the video. Anything. Say hello. Anything you all like. So the questions I have asked in the video for you is to reply to in the comments in case you've forgotten. What would you like to see in a giveaway? Have you tried the silicone sponge? I even forgot there for a minute. <laughs> Have you tried the silicone sponges? What do you think? Are you going to stick to your beauty blender or are you going to go forward using a silicone sponge? Let me know. I really want to know. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, as I said, don't forget to give it a little thumbs up and I will see you all again soon. Bye.